back in March of 1998. A kid came home, shot himself in the head after getting rejected by his crush. This kid shot himself in the living room after getting rejected by his by his crush in the rural area of of Southern California, somewhere in Southern California. And you know, this kid had a crush on this girl for some time. Some there's other theories and speculations saying that this this kid might have shot himself for another reason. Uh, there's other stories that say that this kid, you know, went to his crush's home and she and he saw his his crush getting raped by a man, by a by a 45 year old man, and maybe he was traumatized enough to shoot himself. And some say that he was crying, you know, and shot himself with a magnum, um, and he uh, shot himself in the head. And of course, some say he was probably drama dramatized to want to say that story. You know, to say that, you know, his crush rejected him. I kind of believe he probably saw, yeah, he saw what happened. Probably saw the girl getting his crush getting raped and he was probably dramatized after that. But that's a true story. It's heard by a lot of, a lot of uh, people who, who know the family of this kid. This happened in 98. So, some time ago now and... Of course, you know, this was just a very bad situation for the family, of course. You know, condol condolences go to them. But uh, now for the scary part, you know, this is a very rural area here. So you know, it's a very lonely area. It's the valley full of sprinklers and tumbleweeds and carrot fields. And of course, where this happened, it's just terrifying to know. Some say they, the people who have lived here, they heard, they've encountered cries they've encountered screams one time this man went home and went to eat his meal right he went to the kitchen and went back into the to his room of course only 40 feet from his from his room he started hearing this scream that got louder louder and louder and of course he did not know what to do it, just, it was just very scary and he heard it for like two seconds until it just gone boom disappeared but he heard it right near like that screen was running near in the kitchen to the dining room into the hall into into the the place where he shot himself into the living room so maybe that's where the scream ended and it was just really terrifying to hear and it was around 1 30 in the morning so it makes the things more scary to hear this at night some say they've heard screams they've heard uh loud screams and uh, you know, of course like that one and also loud cries <laughs> now of course that's a loud scream as well that's that's one that a lot of people have heard loud cries were heard as well others have seen shadows and worst of them all others have seen a face and this is the face they have seen back in november 11th of 2022 their most recent encounter was this face a man was unloading groceries and the one who lives there as well as of right now seeing this face looking straight dead eye on him just looking at him and it was just tracking him down as he was running away from this figure and he was just alone in groceries so just imagine seeing this figure in front of you at night it was like at eight at night and it was really dark no moon just you know, just really dark outside. And of course, seeing that face at night is just really terrifying. And of course, a lot of encountered uh, cries, you know, like a kid sobbing, you know, for help. And it's just scary. And people have said that they haven't seen anything where that cry was sound. And many unusual sounds have been heard. And of course, you know, it's just really scary. Prayers go to the family, of course. If you want many of these stories, uh, click subscribe on.